Come on, don't act as if you've never done washing before. I like my colours as you can see. Um, I like... I do have a lot of blue, I noticed that, but it isn't always the case, you know, like... I do like other colours. Okay, look, purple's not far off blue, I know, but... Hey. I could be doing my Talvin talks out here, but I'm not gonna do it like this today. I obviously just need to... Um, put something else on. <laughs> Hey guys, and welcome to, you know what it is, it's Talvin Talks, Talvin Talks, it's... Exactly. So today we're going to be discussing on... Hate to say it, but I want to get the negative out of the way first so we can move straight on. We have to deal with it. The homophobic attacks <clears throat> on two gentlemen down on her street in my local hometown, in England, in Birmingham, there was an attack a few days ago now, but... Okay. The updates keep coming in and... <laughs> I think I was right. Also, we're going to be talking about the queen of the gays, the queen of the gays. We've got Madge, we've got Madge coming through, yo. Got big up Madge, big up Madge. Madge Madonna. <laughs> you guys know who I'm on about. I'm on about the queen Madge Madonna. <laughs> She's celebrating her 40th anniversary of her career and it's celebrated with Warner Music who have always supported her. And if you're wondering why I'm wearing a tie with no shirt, it's my style. It's just as why has it got this little piece of curl at the front like Superman, you know, and earrings in like, oh my gosh, I'm not even gonna remove that. Yeah, and also guys, did you enjoy my promo? <laughs> So anyway guys, yeah, so there's two gentlemen, Rob and Patrick, outside the lovely town of Hurst Street, where I rave, where I enjoy myself, though I haven't been for a while, even before the pandemic. So they were outside of Missing, the Missing Bar. Now I know that bar is kind of cool and relaxed, there's not usually much problems outside of there. In fact, Hurst Street in general, but they were standing outside and according to them, there was a black SUV that approached them and actually um, started shouting off some homophobic abuse and all this stuff. And th guys, this is all going on at like 4am and the pandemic's hitting, people are out enjoying themselves and this is happening. I haven't been out yet. Thank goodness, didn't I say in my previous videos guys that I've been staying home and I'm just enjoying myself from here but I want to know what you guys get up to. This is not what I want you guys to be getting up to on both parts and I'll tell you for why, one second. Patrick, Patrick had his phone taken. Which one of these is Patrick? I'm not, I'm not sure. I'll put an arrow, okay, or something, um, if I do. So his phone was taken by some Asian guys, this is what they said, um, in a black SUV, and because he was recording them, they took the phone, drove off with it. So what I don't understand is, why is a woman in her 20s chasing the car down and trying to get the phone back to the point where wrongfully she's dragged across by the car like she was a dog i don't i don't like that stupid inhumane behavior that drives me crazy <sighs> see my even my flaps going down now it's so tired of all this crap yeah so she gets dragged off by the car then eventually they have to stop a red light oh my gosh did it take the red light at the end of the road just for them to stop dragging another human being let alone a female you absolute idiots i'm so ashamed and so upset and so disappointed more than anything honestly i really am so then after coincidentally the red light comes on they stop i know where this is by the way i know that point and i have seen the cars go talvin talvin i'll give my opinion afterwards okay so then rob chased them down challenged them for the phone back in all this business, remember the word challenge, okay? And they got out and beat him with a bottle to the point where he's all bloody and messy. Obviously really hurt the man, okay? And it's just something you don't do. There's other answers apart from violence. Call me stupid, Message. naive. Maybe I am, but at the same time, I'm just going over my experience. It just doesn't... I don't want to cry and I don't want to get upset. It's Friday. I've got stuff going on just like everybody else. You know what? This is a platform for positivity. Sometimes you gotta dig it up, you know what I mean? Dig up the dirt to get to the good. Yeah, so police are investigating it as a homophobic attack, rightfully so. Thank you, please, yay! Okay, now all the media's kicking in, all in defense of these guys. People have approached me telling me what had happened in my local hometown. What's confusing to me is, now, I've been down her street, I've been challenged, 
<laughs> I've been challenged. I would not challenge anyone else who obviously is ignorant and doesn't have an understanding or a belief or a care about a certain community. You know what your beliefs are. Don't be around it, leave it alone. There's so many things on this earth that we all don't agree with. Do we all start calling it out every single time? I don't think so. How would we get jobs? How I'm not even going to go on the rant, okay? But anyway, I want to say to you guys, I'm so sorry. I'm so gutted that this happened to you in a place where you should be comfortable and be yourself. Where I'm always comfortable. I have had problems down there. But what are you doing? Chasing the phone for one. Mm -hmm. That 20-year-old girl. Yeah, she's chasing down for the phone for her mate. Or I don't know who she was or whatever. You guys must have been drunk or something. The girl got dragged. Why, man? Why... So then it all kind of, kind of spiralled. Then Rob goes and challenges them. And they beat him down so bad. So since the police is involved, okay. And it's classed as a homophobic attack. When you get any attack or anyone stealing from you. Or anything like that. What do you do? Obvious You message. leave the phone alone. You let them take the money. Everyone knows that you don't stand there and try and fight back for things that can be replaced. So it's just a spiral of an unfortunate events. Now you're gonna get homophobia anyway. We can't erase it out completely. People need to be themselves. But please guys, in the car, the black SUV, I'm not here to attack on you. I'm telling you what you've done is very wrong as a human being that shares this earth, that um, accepts you. You should accept me and all the rest. But if you don't accept it, don't be shouting out slurs And again, I was not there I'm going by the facts that were there And I think I'm being fair enough I'm not going to ruin my flipping Friday And I don't want to ruin yours guys Let's move on to something more fun Before I break into tears Because I'll tell you something It's not flipping worth it This is stupid Come on guys, we're in 2021 We've got over a pandemic And stupidness like that And I'm sure people have had worse things off Than shouting abuse And going to fight back for a flipping phone <sighs> Why? Me tell you, sir, people are muddy. As I've got the fun out, let's move to Madge. Hey, Madge. Well, I know it's not your 40th. I remember you, when you were 40, everyone was complaining that you're, um, do I still need this now? Everyone was complaining, you know, that you need to dress better and stuff and represent what 40 is. Now everyone's doing everything. So back then I didn't have faults with you and now I don't. You're not my idol, girl, but I admire you and I respect you and I can be a very good friend, Madge. Come on, Madge. I know you linked with Dennis Rodman back in the day. Do you know what I'm saying? Don't I have Dennis Rodman-esque? <laughs> Let me add there guys, I get names wrong a lot of the times and pronunciations Even though I've placed them in the video sometimes Remember I'm not looking at this, I'm editing <laughs> So Madge, you know what? Brilliant on you So Madge, you've got Warner Music supporting you They have done since 1982 So that's yeah like, since basically the start of your career So what they're doing is releasing a, a catalogue of stuff Including 17 studio albums Soundtrack recordings a live album and compilations of many things. Basically, it's going to be a really good reboot of a lot of your stuff, Madge. Like her. I can't say the word. It obviously does not exist here. You know what, though? i got to say this, though. Madge, thank you. You know, I looked up the, uh, the picture that actually went with all this situation when I was doing my research. <laughs> Madge, you love having next to nothing on. And I get it now. Like, when I was younger, then I was like, go for it, go for it. Now I kind of understand. Don't really do it now, Madge. You still look good. I love you, Madge. I still love you. I do. Mwah. I was inspired. In fact, so much so, Madge. See this here. So, this is what I wanted to try. Okay, so let me get the chair back. Oh, that's not going to work. I had to move aside, to be honest, because that's where it's coming. <laughs> Let me come back. Yeah, so, okay, basically. <laughs> no, I, I appreciate that because you know what? You've been hidden for a while and they just want to thank you as well, Madge, I think, in some way because you stuck with them. Got a loving relationship. They have supported her from day one. They pushed her visions when no one else really would. To us as an audience, so we have them to thank for that. Warner Music, thank you very much for bringing us Madge, queen of the gays. So thank Hello. you, Madge, very Boom. much. I do appreciate what you said. Okay, stop that. I do appreciate everything that you do. And you have been a, you've been a true gay icon. Though I do think that Gaga is up and coming, but she's always give you a shout out in respect. <laughs> and okay, guys, well, I'm doing okay. I love you. It's not always easy. See me be like, hey, I told you 
the things that I'm going through, well, some of them, you know, everyone has to put a face on, but my face, my mask is me anyway. <laughs> and those that know me know that's so true. I'm yours in your mind. You are with me. You are mine. Please, guys, it's Friday, 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 it's Friday. Enjoy your Friday, guys, and enjoy the rest of your weekend. Please, 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 guys, because I'm going to get teary now. Please be careful, because there are stupid people out there that you don't know what they look like. In fact, you know what? People aren't bad, they do bad things. People aren't good, they do good things. And people aren't stupid, they do stupid things. So don't be one of them that does either of the things that is going to affect everyone else and ruin everyone else's already crazy time. So I love you guys and enjoy your Friday. Tell me, what do you think about the attack? Were any of you guys there? Tell me, I need more information because I'm just giving my opinion here and I'm, you know, I'm trying to weigh it up. You know, let me know what do you think and isn't it stupid? Do we need this? Please comment and let me know, man. Let me know what you think about all this crap. So, and also, Madge, Madge, like her. <laughs> and are you going to be buying her collection, her 40th anniversary of her um, recording debut? Are you going to get the stuff? I don't really purchase much things, for, even from artists that I love. There are a few that I do think is worth it. And Madge, you know what? I respect you so much, my love. Queen Madge! Queen match! Oh, match! <laughs> match! Match! Queen match! <laughs> but anyway, guys, yeah, let me know, let me know what you think about Madge and her um, 40th um, recording celebration uh, debut and all this business. I say all this business like I'm not interested. I'm definitely going to be following it up. I will see you, my babies, very soon. Talvin loves you, and if I haven't proved it already, you get me. I know you do, and I love you so much. I do. I do love you. Okay. You should always put your clothes out when it's sunny. Yeah, it's gonna rain now. You know, I never used to like summer so much, but I'm kind of missing it a little bit now.